Hey guys, welcome back to another Random Distractions where we're playing Tell Me Why. And uh, <laughs> this is kind of an interesting, I guess, mechanic that we have so far of we're sorting out the furniture. I never thought I would say that in a for a video game, but um, we gotta clean the coffee table and sort out the furniture that we want to sell, keep, and all that good stuff since they're getting ready to sell this house. All right, up? I'll clean it up. Thanks. While you do that, I'll check out the furniture. I'm guessing you want to keep the coffee table? Uh, yeah. Is that okay? Sure. I'm not really planning on bringing furniture to Denali. And if I need a base in Juno, you'll have all the furniture I need. How very non-committal of you. <laughs> all right, I'll keep it. I really like that armchair. It'll look sharp next to your tree stump nightstand. I'll be the most stylish mountain man ever. <laughs> but I was actually thinking it should go in your library. Library? We may not even have a living room. <laughs> I have faith in you. Wait, what am I looking at? Maybe it'll be salvageable with a deep clean? Okay. And finally. I hate to say it, but the couches get a one-way ticket to the dump. No protest here. I think I have permanent knee damage from a decade of bumping into the corner of those damn things. <laughs> well, then that's it for the living room. You are relieved from your duties. He's not going to jump up and do the cha-cha. What about me? I want to clean the fish, too. It's not even your fish. You didn't catch anything. Ugh. Only because you wouldn't stop talking and scared all the fish away. Keep your eyes on what you're doing. Allison, when we're done with this half, you can take over and do the other one. That sound fair? Yes. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. You're right. I was kind of being a brat. Hey, Allison, come take a break with me. Ugh, gross stain is gross. Ugh, what happened? Some unfortunate spillage that brought about the end of indoor tea parties. I hid the stain with my toys, forgetting that they would eventually be picked up. Brilliant <laughs> move, Ronan. Well, I seem to recall a time you stole an egg, put it on the couch, and sat on it because you wanted a pet chicken. <laughs> we don't talk about that. Uh-huh. Well, at least I didn't leave a stain. Hey, clean freak. You want coffee? That's a nice face. I wonder if my horse figurine is still in there. Your what now? You know, my blue toy horse. With the kind of melted face. The one you stole from me. What? That never happened. Yeah, it did. I won it at that little Halloween carnival they had at the school every year. You grabbed it and hid it in the pot. Then when I tried to get it back, you said there was a snake inside too. <clears throat> Whatever you say, horse face. We have the same face. <laughs> Major Allison. Anything else we can do? What about that dresser? If you want your towels to rot, go for it. Maybe someone could clean it up? It's well made. Your call. Keeping it. Thanks for clearing out those cabinets. Not my pleasure. 
Oh, ew, ew, ew. Raven Sarah. Oh, God. I can still taste it. Put it away. Ugh. Say ah. Uh... Ah. I remember cutting off shaving cream beards with these. Oh, yeah. <laughs> like tongue, dep tongue depressors, I guess. Let's see. Uh... So is that their mom on the beach? Everywhere I look, there's just stuff, stuff, and more stuff. Mary and the magpie. Hello, ancient broken down machines. That will be the future owner's problem. <laughs> I'm breaking. This dude needs his bean juice. Okay, so I think we got everything. Let's... <sighs> I'm breaking. This dude needs his bean juice. It's just the same thing. Okay. Let's join him over here. Starting the fire again? Yeah, I'm gonna boil some water. You want something to drink? Choose tea or choose coffee. I'll Earl go with Grey tea. Or chai. Your call. I'm fixing myself a good old cup of joe. Ah, a nice pot of wakey wakey juice. Papa needs his rocket fuel. <sighs> I am so glad Eddie came through on the caffeine. <laughs> Did you hear that? <gasps> the Ice King is sending us a warning. shall feel my anger in your gut. Hear it in the wind. Whoosh! <laughs> huh. Do you think the Ice King would really react that way? He may be intimidating, but he's always fair and never mean. Maybe he tells the goblins to help the people they hurt instead? Great idea, sweetie. Why don't we think about it at dinner? I'll put everything away for safekeeping while you go wash your hands. Can you put them in the binder so they don't get stained? Of course, love. Hmm. Binder. I still think my dark and twisty version was better. We put so many hours into that book. Yeah. Our binder was full of extra drawings and incomplete stories. Think they're all still in the kitchen drawer? We should go take a look. Hey, Allison. Allison's first drafts. <laughs> right. Because I didn't contribute at all. Come on. I know you did. I can't believe she kept all these. <laughs> You'd think putting them on the fridge for a couple of weeks would have been enough. You know how we thought of ourselves as the goblins? Did you ever get the sense that... Maybe Marianne was the princess in the stories? Uh, yeah. She called her bedroom the princess's sanctum. And she was all alone in the woods, in this house, until we showed up. She was. Alone. But with a few friends who helped her along the way. What are you doing? Research. So, if Marianne was the princess, then who were all the rest? And here we go. Oh, come on. Humor me. We have Tessa, Eddie, and Sam. So Tessa... 
Yes, sir. I think it would have been... Hmm. Pelican. She was the most generous one. <laughs> yeah. But there was always a catch. Yep, I'm thinking that's Tessa. Okay. You go here. No, you don't go there. Mm, this one. Okay. Oh, poor Moose. Really didn't do him justice. Hmm. Justice? Kind of ironic, huh? <laughs> Considering he was the lawful good one. Too bad the law isn't really just. You done? I think so. The bear was the most helpful one. He was always around. Yep, that's Sam. What? No. I mean, he was kind of always there, lurking. All right, I think I'm done. You sure? How do you like them apples? You know, I think you might be onto something. What about these guys? I don't see them being real life people, or this one. These specific human attributes you have assigned to these forest animals are truly thought provoking. Indubitably. <laughs> Mad Hunter. Yep, totally Marianne. Why a princess, though? Why not a queen? She hated authority. Yeah, she'd have been a terrible ruler. <laughs> Didn't say anything about this guy. Okay. You better hurry, or the Mad Hunter will catch us! We need to hide. This way! <gasps> what's... What's going on? I... I don't know. I, is he here? Is he really here? Uh, I'm scared. Oh, yeah, go back to the forest. Hmm. I forgot about that. We'd been pretending he was there. And then suddenly he was. That was the only time that happened, right? Allison, wait, it felt way too real. It was us pushing our imagination way too far. Mm. Great. Hello? Sam Kansky, grandmaster of bad timing. <laughs> We're not done with this conversation. Morning, Sam. Well, hi, goblins. I ran into Chief Brown who said you were starting to clean up on the house this morning, so, uh, I kind of figured you might need some supplies. That's... Thank you. That was very thoughtful. Oh, uh, also got something for you, Tyler. Every man needs a good knife. There you are. Thanks, Sam. <laughs> Good. Good, yeah. Oh, and before I forget, for the lady of the house. <laughs> it was your mom's favorite recipe. Still make it darn near every week. Think of her every time. Uh, thanks. But we don't have a stove. Still no electricity. Oh, yeah. That fuse box is busted. <laughs> Just another thing I've been meaning to put back together around here. Where is it? I can take care of it. Oh, I don't doubt you can. But, uh, I've been kicking this thing back to life for the last 20-some years. I'll give you a hand. All right. Box is in the barn. Follow me. We'll be right behind you. That was nice of Sam. Oh, 
Well, I guess old bears can learn new tricks. <laughs> Come on. Let's go get our electricity back on. All right. Well, I'll go ahead and stop it here. Thanks again for joining me for another random distractions of Tell Me Why. Um, so, yeah, I'm kind of wondering about that Mad Hunter. If that is something that's that they conjured up with the this power or whatever that they have uh or if it's something that actually is uh outside of their control because it looked like it appeared at the uh police office uh as where as well and it was also on that same night so um so yeah so we'll see what happens on the next one uh would definitely appreciate a like on the video and make sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell uh, kind of like this bell here, um, so you'll know when the next one drops. Uh, until then, I hope you have a good one.